I love the combination of these three ingredients so 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 much because massaging the scalp with the oil stimulates new hair growth on um, the stop or hair loss and they promote healthy hair growth altogether. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Linda. If this is your first time here, welcome to my channel. So on this channel, I do a lot of DIYs for natural hair. So with that being said, I have another great DIY video for you guys today. So let's jump right into it. So you guys, I'm so excited about today's video. I've used these ingredients before, but separately, I never used them together before. But you guys, I've been using this oil for about seven days now, and I can tell you guys, I love it. I so the ingredients that I'm talking about are fennel seeds, star anise, and ginger. I've used star anise before. Star anise is very, very powerful. It's just like a clove, very, very good when it comes to growing and thickening your hair. Star anise is very, very good. And fennel seeds, I have not seen fennel seeds on here a lot, but fennel seeds are very, very good. It's not only for uh, to use in the kitchen, but they're really, really good when it comes to stopping hair falls, when it comes to growing new hair. Star ups, fennel seeds are very, very good. And ginger, you guys know, ginger treats scalp. If you have any issue with your scalp, ginger is your friend. Uh, like, allow ginger in all your ingredients that you use for your hair, shampoo, conditioner, or oil. Just like throw a little ginger in there and then the scalp issues will be solved so here i am the measurements i'm using today which i always use in all my videos is one eighth cup i'm gonna use one eighth cup of star um of star anise which is about a handful and uh, when it comes to the fennel seeds i'm using also one eighth cup as well and i'm gonna go ahead and um just my ginger is about a handful as well about that much but when you put it in your hand it's about a handful i cleaned it i cut it into pieces um let me show you guys about a handful i'm gonna add all those three ingredients together i'm gonna be using olive oil today organic olive oil i'm gonna be using three of the one eighth cup and i'm gonna add it to my blender and i'm gonna go ahead and blend everything together Star anise is used to lubricate hair. In addition, it also helps to repair damaged hair. Like massaging your scalp with star anise oil, it stimulates hair growth, it promotes healthy hair growth, it stops hair fall. And it will come to ginger, you guys. I love, love, love ginger. Ginger helps improve the circulation of the scalp while also stimulating each hair follicle, which in turn promotes healthy and natural hair growth. So after I finished blending everything, I took my, my cooking pot and I transferred uh, the ingredients and the oil into my cooking pot. I took it to the stove. Like this, uh, these ingredients don't have a lot of water inside of them. The only thing that have water is ginger. So you shouldn't let the oil stay on the stove for too long. I only let it stay for three minutes and watch out for the change of color. Once it changes color, that's good enough. And then I took it off the stove. I let it sit to cool off a little bit and then I training so that's what I'm doing that's what I'm showing you guys here I have not seen a lot of people use fennel seed on here but fennel seed is really 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 good when your hair is falling or you losing your edges uh, fennel seed is the one that you should be using to solve these issues the antioxidant and nutrient present in fennel seed strengthens the root of your hair and give your follicles some life I'm gonna go ahead and add 1 8 cup of emla oil to my oil. The reason why I'm doing this, I love emla oil, it promotes healthy hair growth, but because I'm using all this kitchen ingredient, this smell like food, so I'm trying to add the emla oil so to tame down the smell a little bit. And of course, you guys already know we do not mix peppermint oil. Peppermint oil is so good with the scalp, you guys. If you're having any issue with your scalp, scalp inflammation, scalp disease, include peppermint oil in. In your oil you should be good this is another good one edge dope oil growth use this for your edges and you're gonna thank me later you guys i've been bringing you guys so much do not sleep on me this is at the local beauty supply for five dollars it's very 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 good i've used it when i had a kid and my edges were totally gone they say bye bye I went ahead and started using the edge uh, growth oil and it really really helped so this is the oil is ready we're gonna go ahead and apply it in my hair so my hair is freshly washed the tangle um 
I always say this whenever you're using any new ingredients in your hair make sure the hair is washed you have nothing else in your hair and then apply the oil right now I have shea butter and mango butter in my hair those are the two things that I have in my hair they just makes my hair very very easy to detangle very very manageable that's why I use them first before I use anything else so here I am I'm just gonna go ahead and massage my scalp with the oil very very well apply it on um, to the tip of my hair um, and then uh, comb through my hair like I'm doing here so I've done it to the first section I moved on to the next section I've done the same thing with every single section oh I forgot to mention so when I take the hair out I spray my hair first um, and then I apply the oil in my hair and then I comb through my hair because I'm trying to make sure the oil gets through every single follicles of the hair is very 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 important and let's not forget to massage the scalp massaging the scalp with the oil that's what promotes the healthy hair growth so I did the same thing throughout the whole entire hair and then at the end of it um I don't think I show it in the video but at the end of it I use clove water I split I spray I can't talk today I spray clove water throughout my whole entire hair you guys but this is it you guys I love 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 this combination you guys try it and let me know under the comment section did you guys like it did you not like it? I've been using this for one week you guys and I love it I love it love it love it love it but you guys thank you so much for watching this video uh, thank you for the support you guys have been showing me I appreciate it this is the end of this video please don't forget to share like and subscribe to your your girl's channel please give me a thumbs up and then until next time i'll see you guys again but this is it i love you guys so much i'll see you guys look at my hair y'all yeah just look at my hair watch the beginning of my videos when i started this youtube hair journey and look at me now these ingredients are working do not listen to what everybody's telling you that they don't use oil or butter in their hair this is working but you guys thank you so much i love you guys i'll see you guys again in my next video bye bye take care